Uh, yeah, we got knocked down to zero by Aster. Uh, we're playing that again. If we're, what can we expect from the match? Emotionally speaking, are we driven by rage? Wanting mm -hmm. revenge? Uh, what angles are we trying to approach this match? I would say we're not driven by rage. I mean, I can only speak for myself. I hope you guys weren't driven by rage. I'm I'm uh, inspired by Sasuke <laughs> and I'm coming for revenge. As far as I'm concerned, Aster or Itachi and I will take him down. Uh, of course, we'll approach, we'll approach the match as we do in any other match. Uh, I think emotions are out of it. Uh, we lost to them because they're a good team. Uh, we learned from from our games against them. Uh, and now we've beaten oh, three teams since then. So, I mean, we're not, we're not the same as we were when we played them before. Uh, so, I guess that's, yeah, that's our angle. Uh, we've gotten better. <laughs> yeah, it is you, bro. You were, you were doing most of the talking with the other team. I mean, there was not a lot going on, and we were kind of forced to just sit there and look at a pause to Dora game. We're not allowed to tab out, not allowed to like listen to music. We're just. We weren't even allowed to go to the bathroom for the first hour because the admins were busy helping OG, so we couldn't get a response on whether that would be allowed. So it was just uh, trying to stay entertained in whatever way possible. Uh, I think we talked about pretty much everything you can imagine. I you know uh, there were even random Latin facts that came out of my mouth to represent how, <laughs> how deep I had to dig. So yeah, I, I can't remember any specifics, but there was just a lot of trying to fill the black space. Significance of my hat? Not really. Was, I think one of my friends or somebody said it looks better on me than my, on my fiance. So we just kind of swapped caps. She took my black cap and I took her green cap. That's kind of the story. I just like wearing uh, stuff on my head. Unfortunately, it's not quite the beanie season in Singapore. It's a bit uh, too warm for that. Why did I say to Tommy? I know he said something like, you have to go win this whole thing now. Uh, and I probably just said, I promised I'd try my best or well, we're going to do it. You know, it feels like it was so long ago. Maybe it wasn't. Uh, yeah, something along those lines. Argentino. Uh, I believe in like, uh, don't say France. No. <laughs> don't say France. <laughs> because I haven't, we haven't like no vested interest in this tournament because Sweden didn't qualify. Actually, Sweden didn't want to go in the first place. Yeah, true. You know, boycott. Uh, I mean, the most difficult thing to think Thunder is always surviving the early game because they will kind of run at you and they will try to kill you and they're very very good at it so getting past like the first 20 minutes of the game I think is probably the most difficult thing uh, but in this specific series I think it was just trying to keep your head cool and not getting too uh, stressed out by what's happening and just you know trying to do what you need to do I mean, I know for myself at least, it was an active decision to switch from all to Dota and it wasn't like, I'm just going to play Dota for fun. Uh, so yeah, there was a very specific moment when I decided to switch. It was like either switch or go study or do something else. And I decided I wanted to play Dota. So it was always like kind of with a goal in mind to make it. Yeah. It's for me, by the time I went to my, my first Dota lab, I think I was I was 16. I was still school, but we played some. Uh, uh, what was it, called? it was by it was at South by Southwest. It was a it's a monster tournament with like four teams. It was CG. It was at probably Team Liquid at the time with like Boba and some dudes, <laughs> and then two other teams. Uh, and we just went to this four man tournament uh, and we won. And I think after that it was just like. Yeah, I was on AG and it was just 
Both been happy. I just think we have a lot of experience throwing games, <laughs> at least for this side. Uh, it's not it's not something unusual, so I guess it's just a lot of experience and uh, weird and awkward games. Uh, probably CSGO. It's a cool game. Old school game. Easy to shoot. I'm playing with it, 100%. <laughs> Same, to be honest. No, I don't think there are that many good like games that we want to play for twelve hours a day. Like Dota is already like yeah, like it's kind of pushing it, you know. I get it. And I think I feel like CS would be even more repetitive. Like I don't know. Yeah. I think I probably if I could have, I would probably play melee. I think it would be really fun. It's very different. I mean, it's it, it's really awesome to be here as a player. I mean, casting was fun and all, but there's always a part of you when you're casting that you get to see everyone and you get to see people win. And you don't even have a chance to stop them. And all you have to do is talk about how good they are. Um, which is, there's definitely a side of you that doesn't want to do that. But uh, no, casting was, was a fun experience. I mean, I had a very fun time at Kaitan very well received, which is obviously um, probably made the experience much better for me. Uh, also, like working with a lot of people, like Woody Pixel is great. It's pretty hard not to do a good job when you're standing next to someone so passionate. And, you know, he's just jumping around yelling. If you haven't seen him in real life, you really should, because it's quite an experience. After TI, uh, regardless of the result, I want to go back home and I want to at least have a week or maybe two weeks or maybe three weeks and I, I'm not going to open Dota, I think. And I'm just, I'm just going to chill because we've been on the road for, for a long time this year. Uh, and very, at least this later part of the season has been pretty intense. So I'm just going to wind down, you know, wind down. Yeah. Play some Warcraft 3. Play some Warcraft 3. Yeah. I don't know, I'm gonna be grinding. <laughs> what are the Warcraft My War of Warcraft characters I have no time. Like, it's back to 14 hour days. <laughs> I mean, Blizzard really got the carry players, yeah? Yes, they do. They have all got Ame. World of Warcraft got Monty. We just wanna keep farming. Like, yeah. we stops. <laughs> Easy Sweden. I don't have to travel then. If you could pick anywhere and host a TI. I mean, I really want to go to Australia at some point. Oh. So that would be my answer. I don't know if it's very popular here, but I would want to go to Australia. Flight, Australia or Japan. Japan would be pretty cool. Yeah. Um, who is the SCA Dota player that impresses you the most? So I'm not going to choose among the pros. It's too boring. Uh, but in pubs, there was this guy. I played Lush Rack in my team, and then he played Lush Rack against me, and he won both games. And then I decided to open up his Dota 2 Pro Tracker, and I saw that he had played like 47 games of Lush Rack in the past eight days, and that impressed me a lot. I believe his nickname in pubs was Fervian 2.0. I don't know who it is, but I was very impressed by his ability to play the same hero so many times in such a short time. Well, probably an EU player. Maybe. If it was an EU player, that's not normal. <laughs> I believe one of the words would be depression. I don't know what the other two are. Depression is not sad. Just the Mickey with a one in it. Oh. That's it. My name. My nickname. Thank you. <laughs> uh, I just like copied my brother's friend's nickname when I was like eight. I mean, like, I was on the cafe and I had to create the login. I don't know. Oh, everyone's? Uh, yeah, I chose mine on my cousin's. I was making a Guild Wars character and 
my cousin had Latin nicknames for all of his characters. So I wanted to be cool like him. But I also wanted Latin words. So I just looked up a bunch of Latin words and this was the one that people got to know me by. So I stuck by it. Yeah, uh, mine was kind of just random. Uh, no meaning, really. Just uh, cool letters. Well, I answered this question like 30 times. Like, there's what no is, way. Is, why did you I can, as a, I can say my first nickname actually was from Latin 2 in Warcraft 3. I played under the name Lacrino, which means deer, I believe. That was my name. <laughs> It's still my worker feeling, right? <laughs> <laughs>